Welcome to Averno City. It may look peaceful from here, but trust me, it's rotten to the bone. That's where we come in. Averno's finest. We swore an oath to protect this city. To look out for the citizens walking those streets below. There's bad guys, and there's good guys. And then there's us. All balancing on a knife edge. Fighting each other just to survive. But it's a fight we're losing, and everybody knows it. We're understaffed, underpaid, and overworked. Worse than that, we got targets on our backs, and every low-life punk and thug thinks they can take aim. Heck, a few of us might even deserve those targets. Not all of Averno's finest are that fine. We got our fair share of rot, too. What good is an oath of honor if you got no honor to betray? But me, I believe in the badge. That chunk of metal means something. And hey, some days the good guys come out on top. But most days, most days not so much. All the while, the fight rages on. The lucky ones get a flag and a plaque. The unlucky ones get a flag and a 21-gun salute. Why do we do it? Truth is, for some of us, it's all we know. But for others, it's in our blood. And they remain at large. Chandler, Sayers, you're covering downtown. Keep them peeled. These guys are no joke. You got a bus. All right, I know you're dying to get out there. Can't wait. But before you all charge into the blue, I want to introduce you to our newest tender lamb fresh out of the academy. Bah! Where's Bo Peep when you need her? Yeah, I could tell you where she was last night. This officer graduated from the academy at the top of his class. Yeah, that and 50 cents will get you a cup of coffee. And Nick Cordell Jr. What? No way. Will obviously have some big shoes to fill. Jesus, what the... Seriously? They assigned him here? Kowalski, if I may, I don't have to tell anyone in here about the late Chief Cordell. His stellar record, the respect you had for him, his untimely death. I especially don't have to tell Recruit Officer Cordell, who's lived with it every day of the last five years. But there is one thing I do want to remind you of. Every single one of you took an oath to protect this city, its residents, and your fellow brothers in blue. That's what matters. I don't care what your last name is, who your daddy was, or who you hang out with on your day off. Our worth comes from what we do, not who we know. I want you to welcome Officer Cordell, but I'm not asking you to take it easy on him. On it. Or hard on him. He's a cop. Just like you. Just like me. We're the ones out there making the hard choices. And those choices are what make us who we are. And Cordell, you're gonna have to learn the streets and the precinct the same way these mooks did. Are we clear? Yes, sir. Crystal, sir. Absolutely, sir. Thank you, officers. Watch, Commander. Appreciate it, Chief. Sergeant Kelly? Yeah, boss? The Rook's with you. I pulled the last one. Why do you think I'm giving you this one? Because I did something in a past life? You did something? <laughs> I'll alert the media. Uh. All right, squad. Let's get out there and make Averno City proud. Yes, ma'am. Time to pound pavement. Come on, Rook. Let's go for a drive. Wanna go catch some bad guys?
Welcome to the ACPD, kid. Time for our first mission, sustenance. But, uh, you can drive. My hip's been acting up lately. Oh, and uh, don't worry about the fellas. They like to act tough, but that's just because they don't have my natural good looks and winning personality. You learn all kinds of fancy driving at the academy, but for now, let's just take it slow and steady. Don't want to scratch the paint job on your first day. Swing by the hot dog stand in Chinatown. There's a parking bay there. Good job, rookie. Time for some chow. Tube steak. Breakfast of champions. How'd you take yours, kid? The works. A maximalist. I can respect that. What's the damage, Fareed? Leo, my friend. For you, no charge. Fareed, you old softy. You earn that tip every time, don't you? Ah, breathe it in, kid. Best part of the day. Besides, you can't patrol on an empty stomach. You know, your old man liked his dogs too. Ah, of course you do. We came up through the academy together. Took different paths when we got on the force, though. He wasn't gonna let anything get in his way. And me, well, let's just say, water finds its level. And my level is, uh, easy mode. Ah, Christ on a crutch. Another beautiful moment ruined. Oh well, that's what they're paying us for, right? Central, this is Unit 84, responding code 3. 10484, be advised, suspects are heavily armed. Approach with caution. Okay, kid. You wanted the real deal? This is it.
Now remember, they get one warning. If they don't throw them down, we take them down. Get ready. Police! Freeze! Drop your weapon! Morons! Doesn't look like they're gonna give us a choice. Suspect down. Let's get some backup here. Target is down. Bookman in the ACTV Eye in the Sky, the number one news chopper in Averno City. We're downtown where police are engaged in a fierce shootout following yet another bank robbery. It's not clear yet whether this is the notorious August gang or... Uh, hold on. There's movement at the back of the building. More criminals coming out. They're boarding a vehicle. It's a dark van and it... Oh my goodness. Keep it tuned to ACTV, folks. Looks like we're in for a police pursuit. Get tighter to the suspect! Let's go, let's go, let's go! Watch out! Shot if you can. Get tighter to the suspect. Take him down. Suspect last spotted at Litchfield. Shots fired. Too far away. 
vehicle! Central for some backup. Central, get the cell ready. You have the right to remain silent. 84 to Central. We got a 1015. Pursuit has been terminated. Copy that, 84. All units stand down. I repeat, stand down. Whew! You did good, kid. Not everyone handles a pursuit like that on their first day. You got this kid. Just relax, will you?
Come on, Cordell. There's someone I want you to meet. Mean Gene? What's today's major malfunction? Oh, the usual. Misfiled evidence, sloppy dockets, illegible handwriting, contaminated evidence. I'm surprised some of your friends here made it out of grade school. Cordell, meet Eugene, our evidence guy. Eugene Papadopoulos, at your service. Did Kelly try the old, you drive, my hip hurts routine on you yet? Hey! <laughs> Thought so. He doesn't tend to lift a finger unless there's a gun drawn or a chance he might get pizza. Anyway, my job is to know where everything is. Which basically means tracking down whatever you humps, misfile, mislabel, or otherwise misplace. Uh, we do our best. Oh, I'm well aware of this unit's, uh, limitations. Anyway, when you collect any evidence, you come see me. I'll make sure it's safe. You're a peach, Gene. Never change. Wasn't planning on it. All right, kid. You did good today. But that won't mean a fart in a windstorm tomorrow. I'm out of here. I'll see you in the morning. Unless I die in my sleep. God, that sounds pretty good, doesn't it? <laughs>